Hey Monster fans, welcome back to another video. Today we're looking at one of the most hypnotic on-screen actors of the early sound cinema, Bela Lugosi. At a young age, Lugosi was committed to the stage. He was a member of the Hungarian Royal National Theater, where he played roles like Romeo and even Jesus Christ. After serving in World War I, he continued to act on stage and even got involved in film under the name Arzitz Olt. Due to the political climate in Hungary at the time, Lugosi fled to Germany where he continued to act in films before then heading to the United States. He did not speak a word of English, however, he still found success on stage and later got a bit role in Lon Chaney's 1924 film, He Who Gets Slapped. In October of 1927, Bale landed the role of Dracula on Broadway, which ran for over a year. Despite this, Lugosi was still not near the top of the list to play the lead role when the film was being adapted. However, he fought for the role with much determination, and in 1931, a pop culture icon was born. Lugosi gave the world the final word on vampire portrayals. He set the gold standard with a suave, sexy, yet threatening performance. Lugosi learned his line phonetically for the role, and his accent itself became a staple of Dracula adaptations going forward. Lugosi again in 1931 was set to portray the monster in Frankenstein. This did not pan out however and Karloff took over, becoming the top horror icon of the decade. Despite losing the iconic role and being typecast, Lugosi continued to bring his best to all his roles. He would however join the Frankenstein franchise in 1939's Son of Frankenstein. Lugosi would bring to life the iconic Igor role, where he delivers a powerful performance showing off his range. Igor is pretty funny at times, sympathetic, and even just straight up evil. Although Lugosi's career was a rocky one at best, he has left us with performances that will last an eternity. He put his all into the roles that he was given, even until his final days. Lugosi was born an actor, and died an actor, even being buried in the Dracula cape, showing us that legends never die. Thank you for tuning in to another video. I will be putting a list of great Lugosi films I think you should check out in the description below. If you enjoyed this video, please like and subscribe. And let me know what you think in the comment section. Catch you in the next one.